Still the most beloved animated characters of all time are coming to the big screen at last. Oh, won't you come in? From the filmmakers that brought you the runaway box office hit, Chicken Run. Let's rock and roll! Aardman and DreamWorks Animation are collaborating for a feature-length adventure starring the dynamic duo Wallace and Gromit. Wallace and Gromit are a global phenomenon whose short films have garnered two Academy Awards and have been translated into over 20 languages. Creator and Oscar winner Nick Park is teaming up with Steve Box to direct the wildly inventive film. Oh, very cheeky. It just feels great to finally get Wallace and Gromit out there on the big screen. It's been one of those really long ambitions I've had actually for many, many years. Right, off we go then. Wallace is a good-natured, eccentric, cheese-loving inventor. I'm just crackers about cheese. Gromit, his faithful canine companion, doesn't express himself in words, but his body language speaks volumes. There's a good dog. Their adventure begins in a small town in England, where the townspeople are preparing for their giant vegetable competition. It's a veritable, veritable... Wallace and Gromit are called into action to investigate reports of a mysterious garden-guzzling beast. I feel we're on the cusp of a real breakthrough, lad. The whole humor of it all is that it's all in this little cozy northern town and, uh, uh, you know, with cups of tea and crackers and things. But it, that it just grows exponentially from there and becomes a kind of a mega adventure. Oh, charming! It's no small task for the creative team to bring the delightful duo to life. From sets to wardrobe to facial expressions, every detail of the unique animation style is tailored to create the fantastic world of Wallace and Gromit. All in a night's work, Mrs. Munch. Alongside a host of new characters, the movie features Ray Fiennes as the pompous snob Victor Quartermain. No nonsense with Victor Quartermain. What you see is what you get. And Helena Bonham Carter plays Lady Toddington, an aristocrat who harbors a secret crush on Wallace. Please, Wallace, call me Toddy. Well, I've always been a fan of Wallace and Gromit. I mean, I've always loved them. And they've got such sweet hearts. Oh, oh thanks, Chuck. <laughs> You'll go crackers for the inventive world of Wallace and Gromit. Only in theaters, October 2005. Job well done, man. <laughs>